Hi, and welcome to 3dmotive.com. My name is Stephen G. Wells, and I'm a senior 3D artist. In this introduction to ZBrush series, we're going to be looking at, well, pretty much all that we can in ZBrush. We're going to investigate mat caps. We're going to look at importing a model directly from Maya, or it could be 3D Studio Max, importing it directly into ZBrush using the GoZ functionality. We'll then get into explaining what polygroups are, how you can create them, how you can create different pieces within a particular subtool. We'll then investigate some of the brushes because you're always going to have certain brushes that you're going to use more than others. So we'll go into how you can quickly sculpt on a model, how you can gouge out, how you can smooth the model, how you can switch brushes out. We'll look at poly painting or literally adding color to your meshes, how we can add the colors in, we can invert and have a first and secondary color, how it can paint directly on the model, and how it can even smooth that out and blur it a little bit. We'll then investigate Spotlight, a really fantastic suite in CDBrush that can allow you to take photographs and apply those colors directly to your models. All right, let's get started.